Today, we are exploring the potential of the ammonia engine and its disruptive impact on the future of electric vehicles. Could this new technology be the end of the EV industry? In this critical video, we'll dissect the intricacies of the ammonia engine, discuss its advantages over electric vehicles, and examine the potential challenges it poses for the electric vehicle market. So, buckle up as we navigate through this intriguing landscape of automotive innovation. The ammonia engine, an innovative and eco-friendly technology, has the potential to disrupt the EV industry as we know it. But how, you ask? Ammonia engines have the potential to end the EV industry in a few ways. Let's start by examining its cost. Ammonia engines are far less expensive to construct than electric motors and batteries, and ammonia is a far more affordable fuel than electricity. This implies that compared to electric cars, ammonia-powered vehicles may be substantially less expensive to buy and maintain. Its performance comes next. Electric motors cannot match the potential efficiency and power of ammonia engines. This is because lithium-ion batteries have a lower energy density than ammonia. This implies that compared to electric cars, ammonia-powered vehicles may have more range and accelerate more quickly. The environment is next. Compared to electric cars, ammonia engines may be more ecologically beneficial. This is so because gasoline made of ammonia has no carbon. This implies that cars running on ammonia would not emit any greenhouse gases. Of course, before ammonia engines are extensively marketed, there's still some obstacles to be solved. The fact that ammonia is a poisonous gas is one difficulty. This implies that safety safeguards would be required for cars running on ammonia in order to prevent leakage. Ammonia is not as readily available as gasoline or electricity, which presents another difficulty. This implies that in order to create and transport ammonia fuel, an infrastructure would need to be constructed. A potential new technique for reducing automobile emissions is ammonia engines. Inhaling excessive doses of ammonia can be lethal. Ammonia is an odorless and colorless gas. This implies that in order to prevent leaks, vehicles fueled by ammonia would need to have strong safety systems. The low energy density of ammonia presents another difficulty. Because ammonia has a lower energy density than gasoline, vehicles that run on it would require larger tanks or more frequent recharging. Ultimately, ammonia is not as accessible as electricity or gasoline. This implies that in order to generate and transport ammonia fuel, infrastructure would need to be constructed. All things considered, ammonia engines have the potential to significantly upset the transportation sector. In the future, ammonia-powered cars could take the lead in terms of transportation if the aforementioned difficulties are resolved. Let's examine some innovative solutions for ammonia engine safety and practical issues. Vehicles that run on ammonia may have sensors installed that can identify leaks and, in an emergency, stop the engine. Another option for the vehicle's design is a fail-safe mechanism that stops the engine from starting in case of a leak. Ammonia has a low energy density, thus the vehicles might be built with bigger tanks or more efficient engines to make up for it. Ammonia production could be scaled up to meet the demand for ammonia fuel. Its fueling stations could be built near major highways and transportation hubs. Let's examine a few concrete ways that ammonia engines can cause the EV business to collapse. Commercial fleets may start to favor certain cars over others. Ammonia engines are far less expensive to construct than electric motors and batteries. And ammonia is a far more affordable fuel than electricity. This implies that compared to electric cars, ammonia-powered vehicles may be substantially less expensive to buy and maintain. They would thus be the go-to option for business fleets, which are constantly trying to cut costs. These cars could end up being the ones that buyers choose. Ammonia engines have the potential to become the go-to option for customers if they can be made safe and dependable. This is due to the fact that these cars would be less expensive to buy and maintain than electric vehicles, and they would also have longer ranges and faster acceleration. There may be a need for industry consolidation in EVs. Since the EV market is still in its infancy, several businesses are vying for market share. A rise in demand for ammonia engines could push many of these businesses to merge or cease operations. The new ammonia engine from Toyota is revolutionary. Compared to previous combustion engines, it is more powerful, efficient, and ecologically benign. And all of that is possible because ammonia is a cheap, plentiful, and carbon-neutral fuel. This engine has the potential to completely transform the transportation sector and replace electric cars, or EVs, as the primary means of mobility. The shipping and trucking sectors are already investigating the use of ammonia-powered engines as an alternative fuel. Ammonia-powered trucks and ships are being developed by a number of firms, some of which are already undergoing real-world testing. The first companies to investigate the possibility of ammonia-powered engines in passenger automobiles are GAC and Toyota. 
This is a big breakthrough since it may provide consumers with additional options when it comes to ammonia-powered cars. With its innovative ammonia engine, Toyota may have a significant effect on the EV market. Ammonia engines may cause some EV manufacturers to merge or go out of business if they gain popularity. A combustion engine that works on liquid ammonia has been presented by GAC, a Chinese car maker that manufactures Toyota cars there. The engine is viewed as Toyota's response to the electric vehicle and was developed in collaboration with the automaker. Today's new ammonia engine is like a phoenix rising from the ashes. Just when everyone thought that combustion engines were extinct, Toyota introduced a novel technology that had the potential to revolutionize the automotive industry. It's not only the next big thing. The ammonia engine has the potential to destroy electric vehicles and change the course of automotive history. It is the engine that has the potential to restore Toyota's position as the clear leader in the car industry. In the motor sector, Toyota has a long history of invention. They were the forerunners of the hybrid revolution and are about to take the lead in the ammonia revolution. Envision a world in which ammonia, a cheap, readily available and carbon-neutral fuel, powers automobiles. In this future, Toyota is the clear leader in automobile technology and electric vehicles are out of style. Thanks to Toyota's innovative ammonia engine, that world is now attainable. The engine has the power to alter everything. It's crucial to remember that the EV market is still in its infancy and that new technologies may be created in the future to increase the competitiveness of electric cars over ammonia-powered vehicles. Nonetheless, ammonia engines clearly have promise, and in the future, they may have a significant effect on the transportation sector. Nevertheless, before this can occur, a number of obstacles must be removed. The potential of ammonia engines is evident despite these difficulties. Ammonia engines have the potential to completely transform the transportation sector and replace electric cars as the primary means of mobility if they are able to be effectively marketed. The fact that JAC, a business that exclusively offers electric vehicles, sells close to 50,000 of them each month is indicative of the growing popularity of electric automobiles. Electric vehicles have no emissions, which can assist to lessen air pollution and climate change. Thus, this is excellent news for the environment. The car industry is searching for solutions to lower emissions without sacrificing the ability to build vehicles that are both powerful and efficient for consumers, as seen by GAC's development of an engine driven by ammonia. But as you pointed out, a lot of obstacles must be removed before ammonia-powered automobiles are readily available for purchase. It's still too early to say whether ammonia-powered vehicles will ultimately be more successful than electric vehicles. However, the fact that both technologies are being developed is a sign that the automotive industry is committed to finding ways to reduce emissions and provide consumers with a variety of choices. Opinions vary on whether or not people truly desire a car with an ammonia-powered engine. The potential advantages of ammonia engines such as their affordability, increased efficiency and environmental friendliness could draw in certain individuals. Some could be worried about ammonia's potential hazards to their health, or they might just find electric cars to be more convenient. In the end, a variety of criteria such as the price of ammonia, the accessibility of ammonia filling stations, and the dependability and longevity of ammonia engines will determine the viability of cars driven by ammonia. Future customer preferences may favor ammonia-powered automobiles if these obstacles are resolved. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to stay connected with our journey through the world of innovation. Feel free to share your thoughts and comments below, we'd love to hear from you. Stay tuned for more exciting insights into the world of technology and innovation.